Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy V! Let's continue through the Lock of Ruins to find some more treasure and learn some more blue magic. We'll check out those stairs that I passed up eventually, but let's head down here first. This is where the treasure is. This is the path I choose for victory. Let's see, uh, oh, it's a dead end. Oh, not so fast. It's a secret passage. It's not really a passage, it's a bridge. And we get a gold shield. Gallif will want that as a blue mage eventually. Yeah, right now I'm still at level 18, but by the time I get to the end of this place, I should be at level 20. I want to do that so that I can get, learn a particular blue magic spell, if you know what I mean. Blue magic will get more useful eventually. Let's see what's up here. Oh, just a save point. I don't need it. I have the power of save states! Yeah, blue magic is really more useful towards you know, the second half of the game, really. Not too useful right now. Well, I mean, it is for boss fights, obviously, but not for random battles. I don't want to use it all the time right now. Let's see. Dead end? Yes. Oh, and here's a new enemy, Lamia. You can learn a new blue magic spell from her. Another thing you can do with her is... Well, you control her first to learn the blue magic spell. But, um, more importantly, you can... Well, I'm not going to do it. But you can learn or steal uh, Lamia's tiara from her, which is a very good piece of headgear for your wizards. If they're not dead, that is. It's a rare steal from her, and she does have a common steal, so it's pretty hard to get. But if you got the patience, you know, it could take about half hour, 45 minutes to get them. So, you know, hey, if that's what you want to do, that's great. And we learned Blowfish, a new blue magic spell that can, or well, it does, deal exactly a thousand damage to the target, regardless of defense. So that's pretty useful. Not too many blue magic spells that can deal that kind of damage this at this point in the game. I don't think any of them can, really. And we get a high potion. We can never have enough of those. Can never have enough of potions in general, really. What's with all the gears on the walls there? I mean, they're not even doing anything. Uh-oh. I want to have my Geomancer for this one. Let's see. There she is. Eh, I don't even care about a secondary ability. This won't take long. Let's see, we get some money. Another shuriken. That's pretty good. An ancient sword. A uh, full moon. Uh, ancient sword, if you're using a knight type job class, that could be useful. Full moon. Oh, hold on a sec. And we get a power ring. Okay. Full moon is another boomerang type item. So let's give that to Ferris so we can put her in the back row. And the power ring. It's, well, it's better defense. More strength. Uh, no magic defense, unfortunately. So uh, later on, when monsters start using more magic, that might be a problem. But for right now, it's good for Ferris to have the power ring. So let's give that to her and move her into the back row. And then with the Guardian Knife, let's pass that down to Gallops, cause, so that, well, he can use the extra evade from it. See, this is why I wanted the Geomancer to reveal those pits without having to fall down there. What was she doing? White Mage? Yeah, yeah, she was White Mage. There we go. Oops, no, I don't want her on that. We want her on the Elf Cape. There we go. Nice thing about the Lamias TRs is that they have seven magic defense. Almost no headgear can do that. So it's, it's one of my favorites in the game. You can't get it until, like, almost the end, for the most part. Yay, we're at level 19 already. Am I going the right way? Yeah, I'm going the right way. There we go. Let's see. Oh, there's another pitfall, but we don't have to worry about that. I guess those gears are part of what's keeping this place up in the air. I don't know. You got me on that one, viewers. How are we doing here? Oh, okay. I thought I took more damage in that last battle. <laughs> Just some more of those Lanka Knights. How are they still alive after all this time, anyway? 
see what we got over here. Oh, there's the final save point of the area. Yeah, we're doing okay for now. Wait a minute, Lena? Oh, no, she's not at level 5. Okay, she's doing alright. Man, I'm really going through this place fast. A lot faster than I thought I would. It's just, uh, well, a lot shorter than I thought it was. I was thinking this place was like the equivalent of, uh, Magus's castle. I don't think I want to go this way, do I? Oh, yes I do. Oh, hey, there's King Tycoon. Yeah, we can just walk over holes in the floor. I don't know how you pull that one off, but, well, there it is. Go down here. Okay, here's a new enemy. Arcade Toad! Or Archaic Toad, or something like that. Now, I equipped Bart with the Ice Bow there. Okay, we could hit him too. I was actually gonna go for the Lamia, but, well, whatever. Why did I hit the Arcade Toad? Because now my terrain. or. the World Demon, because now I'm gonna heal it. Idiot. Put yourself, get yourself together, H.C. Bailey. Whatever the expression is. Another nice thing about World Demons is that they can sometimes drop uh, Darkness Bows, which is a slightly better weapon for Bards. It doesn't have any elemental affinity. Uh, it can sometimes inflict darkness, but nothing that I'm really interested in. See, we're not quite at level 20, are we? Oh, wow, we're quite a bit behind than I thought we would be. Huh. I guess I overcompensated for being overleveled to begin with. Well, well, there's King Tycoon, but there, there's a particular monster I want to meet up with around here. Let's see if I can find it. Oh, wait, I can't do that until I'm at level uh, 20 anyway. Well, there's another monster, a variation of it. Hyudora! It's a pretty tough monster. They got a, I think it's a thunder attack that hits everyone, or maybe that's their cousin, but we gotta take him out first. Let's see, easiest way of dealing with him? Control. If you can actually hit him with it, that is. Love Song also helps. I don't know if they're susceptible to it or not, but nope, they're not. Yeah, I think Hyudoras are, uh, they're, they're immune to all that kind of stuff, uh, evidently. But I believe control can work on them. If I can ever hit them with it, that is. There we go. I knew you could do it, Bart. Uh, Love Song really won't help. By the way, Vitality Song, that will cast Regenerate on all your party members. So, I mean, that might be useful for longer boss fights, but I usually have better stuff to do with Gallif, because, well, he has access to Blue Mage. Okay, well, this is the area that I want to be at to learn the next Blue Magic spell, but, uh, I'm not at level 20, and that one can actually take quite a while to get, so, uh, this looks like a good place to stop, and I'll also take some time to run from 15 battles off-screen while I'm here. So, can we save the Earth Crystal? What is King Tycoon up to? Is x Death's revival inevitable? Find out next time when, I, when we meet our ultimate destiny on Let's Play Final Fantasy V! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!